Hi guys! Welcome to Cher Jossie Channel! Quarter 3, Week 6, Day 1 Here are the objectives. First, describe how light is dispersed. Second, perform activities to show that light is refracted. Third, investigate the properties of light. Come on! Let's have fun while learning! To begin with, let's have a review. Please write true if the statement is true and false if it is not. Do this in your science notebook. You may now start. Let's check your answers. For number one, light can be reflected if it is directed towards a mirror. The answer is true. Second, refraction is the bouncing back of light that strikes a clear surface. It is true. Number three, light travels faster in air than in liquids. It is true. Number four, the speed of light remains the same even if travels from one material to another. The answer is false. Number five, when somebody faces a mirror, his reflection can be seen in a reverse manner. The answer is true. I do hope you got a perfect score. I have here a picture. Can you tell something about it? Very good. When do you usually see a rainbow? That's right. Do you know how rainbow was formed? Very good. Rainbows are formed from the interaction of light and the raindrops. Can you identify and label the colors of the rainbow? Very good. Let's have a group activity. It was entitled, I see true colors. Here are the materials, glass with water, bond paper, and bright sunlight. Here are the directions. First, you're going to set a glass of water on top of the table or anywhere that exposed to bright sunlight. Second, place the white bond paper underneath the glass of water. If you don't have the materials with you, you can watch and observe this simple video clip. Let's do an experiment. Here are the materials. Clear glass, water, bond paper, and sunlight. Please watch and observe. What did you notice about the sun's rays that pass through the glass of water when they strike the paper? What were the different colors that you saw? Where do you usually see such kinds of colors? And now, let's have your group presentation. Based on your group activity or visual clip, what happens to the ray of light that passes through the glass of water? Very good. You can notice that they have different colors. What are the different colors that you saw? Can you identify them in order? Very good. You saw the colors of the rainbow, which is red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Or we call it the Roy G. Beeb colors. Where do you usually see such kind of colors? Very good. How did it happen? The colors of the rainbow and all the other colors that we see around us are colors that come from the light of the sun. A rainbow is formed when the light from the sun passes through raindrops. That is why we see a rainbow after it has rained. A rainbow is the result of a sunlight breaking into different colors. We call it the dispersion. When we say dispersion, it is the ability of white light to be broken down into different 
colors. As you can see in this illustration, the white light enters in a prism, it slows down and bends or refracts the colors. That's why it turned out the color red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Here are the things that you should remember. The colors of light is only revealed when light is refracted and dispersed. When it hits a transparent medium such as water, raindrops, or glass prism. Dispersion is the ability of white light to be broken down into different colors such as red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. For better understanding, please get your notebook and answer this activity. Write correct if the statement is right and wrong if it is not. Let's check your answers. For number one, dispersion is the ability to break white light into different colors. The answer is correct. Second, rainbows are formed from the interaction of light and the raindrops. The answer is correct. Number three, a rainbow is a result of imagination. The answer is wrong. Number four, the rainbow consists of eight colors. It is wrong because it consists of seven colors. Number five, the color of the rainbow and all the other colors that we see around us are colors that comes from the light of the sun. It is correct. I do hope you got a perfect score. And for your assignment, can you explain how rainbows are formed? Write your answers on your science notebook. That's all for today, kids. Thank you, kids, for listening. See you again next time. Stay safe, everyone. God bless. Please don't forget to like, comment, and share. Please also click the subscribe button. Thank you.